Out of the millions of active monthly users on Roblox, hundreds of thousands of accounts get hacked with their account, Robux, and all their items stolen. And I don't think you want to be one of those people. So I'm going to be showing you all the different methods hackers use to compromise Roblox accounts and how you can prevent yourself from getting hacked. So this is how Roblox accounts actually get hacked. So one of the first and most common methods hackers use to steal Roblox accounts is a method called cookie logging. And if you don't know what cookies are, it's basically how your computer confirms your account as you. So for example, when you log into Roblox, you'll get a cookie on your computer. And every time you go to roblox.com, you don't have to log back into your account again. If you still don't understand, just to show you how useful cookies are, say I just logged into my account and I wanted to go find a new game, I would go to the discover page. And instead of showing me all these games, it would make me log back into to my account and if i wanted to go ahead and play a game i would go ahead and click on it and it would make me log into my account again so that's how cookies work but why is it so bad if hackers get your cookies well the reason is your cookies contain something called roblo security and if hackers get your roblo security they can literally open the console on their browser paste your roblo security into their console and log straight in, bypassing 2FA and all of that. So how do you avoid getting your cookies stolen? First off, don't download anything. Even if it's from your friends, that could just send all your cookies to the hackers or whoever's trying to get into your account. Also, avoid on clicking on any links because hackers can insert a little line of JavaScript into the URL and that will just send all your info straight to the hacker. So yeah, just avoid clicking on all links, especially if they're from strangers, and avoid downloading any files onto your computer. Also another scam that happens a lot, which kind of relates to cookie logging, because also by using this method, hackers can get a hold of your cookies. It's called the HAR file scam, and basically what will happen is somebody will message you on Discord, or some other social media, and they'll say they wanna make a GFX or some art for you, and to get access to your character, they need this HAR file that HAR file contains your cookies, so you don't want to give it to them. And if somebody does want to make some GFX for you, they don't need any of your file. The next method that hackers use to compromise Roblox accounts is called SIM swapping. And basically what happens is a hacker will call up your phone provider, trying to convince them that it's you and that you lost your phone or that it got stolen or something. If this does work, the hackers will get your SIM in their phone. And once they have this, they can easily reset the password on your account. If you have your phone number connected as 2FA on your account. So to avoid this is actually pretty simple. You just got to go in your settings and get rid of your phone number as two-factor authentication. Before I go into the last method that hackers use, that's compromise accounts with millions of Robux. I'm just going to go over some of the really basic ones. Don't go to any free Robux websites. They'll either steal your cookies or if you do put in your information, they'll just steal your account. Nobody in their right mind really gives out free Robux, so never trust any free Robux generator. Also beware of clone websites. Basically, their websites look exactly like Roblox, but the URL will be a little bit different. And once you go to the website, it'll prompt you to log into your account. And once you do, you basically have just given your username and password to the hackers. So those are some of the other ways hackers can compromise your account. But let's go into the final way hackers use. This method is called social engineering. So basically, whoever's trying to get into your account will contact Roblox block support saying that they forgot the password to their account and what they'll do is they'll try to give proof to Roblox support that it's actually you to try to reset your password. So they'll try to give them an old Robux gift card code that you used on your account before, or maybe an old password, just any information that they can get a hold of to try to convince Roblox support that it's you. And sometimes this actually does work. So to avoid this, never give out any personal information, like old passwords, old gift card codes, or anything along those lines. If hackers really want to get into your account, they'll use it against you. So that's how hackers actually to get into roblox accounts and if you enjoyed this video youtube also thinks you really like this one right here so go ahead and watch it and see if they're right